Charlie Morningstar, the main character in Hasbun Hotel, and the little daughter to Lucifer, the big daddy of all of hell. So I know he is very short compared to the other characters in the show. I just want to talk about that real quick. But we're not here to talk about that beefcake. We're talking about his daughter, the literal princess of hell. Charlie is an immortal hellborn demon who founded the Hasbun Hotel, believing that sinners can be redeemed through trust exercises and bonding. Well, she is misguided on how she's getting them up there. She did get Serpentius there, even though they all think he died for good, which I guess that's gonna be a good plot point for season two when that comes out. As for her relationships, she's kindly involved with Baggy, a former angel turned sinner after, um, I go bye-bye incident. <laughs> Going from her design the pilot to, and changing her voice actor to Erica, people have been enjoying their favorite cinnamon roll back in season one with season two coming out soon. Seeing the old characters come back did get my little brain thinking. If you had no merch up to this point and started liking Charlie, how much would it cost you? So today, that's what I'm going to figure out today. Me and my unpaid team of experienced collectors and elf went on to calculate the ranges that you're about to see today. Will it cost you 50K? Let's find out. Shark Robot has made plenty of stuff for Charlie back in the day but newer merch has been pretty scarce this last year. The only piece of merch that is still available is actually not on the Shark Robot website, but on the Hasbun Hotel website, where you can get the cards and pins of some characters. If you want to try your luck at getting the Charlie card, the trading card packs are $6, and the Charlie pin is $15. If you want to try to get the other pieces of the Charlie merch, you're going to need to try sites like eBay and Macari to get the rest of the collection. I would say most of the ranges come from Akari, but when you see the highest listed prices for some of these ranges, you're gonna know it came from eBay. <laughs> Without further ado, let's get into the plushies. Charlie had two plushies made back in the day. The first one we're gonna talk about is the normal Charlie plushie, released in June 18, 2020. It was a pre-order that had a limited stock later added to the website. There is a fake in circulation of this plushie. The face of the knockoff is off-center, has darker hair, the bow tie is smaller, and made of different material, and two buttons are located directly under the bow tie of the fake that is not located on the original. The range for this one would be $60 to $150. And the last plushie made was the Demon Charlie plushie, released also on June 18, 2020. This was a pre-order that was sold with Demon Alistair as a bundle that included a bonus pin, which we'll talk about later. The range for getting it now would be between $162.50 and $298.44. I wish I was making this shit up, and yes, it came from eBay. <laughs> now we have the Sandies. This section is about to be a doozy real fast. On February 9, 2022, Sandies were the newest item hitting the shelves, with them releasing figures of the main four characters of Hell of a Boss and Hasbun Hotel. So originally this was listed for $29.95 back on the day, but if you want one now, it's gonna cost you between $25 and $2,000 to get this thing. I wish I was joking. This is the literal listing that I found. You can't make this shit up. Next is the Demon Charlie Sandy, released on September 21st, 2022 for Halloween. It was on the website for a while before selling out, but that does not mean it's gonna be cheap. You can find this standee list between 20 to 200. Next one is the Valentine's Day Demon Charlie, released in February 13, 2023. This one was pretty hard to find reselling since eBay isn't that helpful and sellers unlist their listings once they sell them, so info will be lacking right now. Before I could find, there was only one listing for this thing, and it was $250. The last standee release alongside the Demon Charlie Valentine's Day theme standee was the Charlie plus Baggy standee. Your mom is gonna hate you for this because that range that I found is gonna be between $55 and $999.99. I, I wish I was joking. <laughs> The next category is the one and only lanyard of Charlie. Released on February 9, 2022, they sold out pretty fast and have not been restocked since. The only one I could find was sold for $50. Next is the keychain made for this little dude. 
first one made was the Pinup Charlie Keychain in 2022. I can only find one record of being sold for 20, which I think if it's sold now, it would not be 20, but take it as you will. <laughs> Still going in that order, the Summer Charlie and Summer Demon Charlie is next in line, released in 2022 summer. The ranges for these two are pretty similar with the normal Charlie being ranged from 15 to 75 and the Demon form ranged between 42 and $99.69. and <laughs> Nice. Next is the Witch Charlie keychain released during Halloween of 2022. The range for this glittery keychain is going to be between $18 to $59.99. During the Black Friday merch drop, we finally got normal keychains for the characters. Charlie's keychain sold out and has never been restocked again, but you can find the list of between 14 and 21. Also during Black Friday was the release of the holiday keychain that featured all the Hasbin Hotel crew. I only ever found one listing for this thing, being $37. The last keychain for Charlie is the Cute Pinup Demon Charlie keychain, released during Valentine's Day drop of 2023. This one was pretty hard to find listings for, so the range I found from what was available was 21 to 30. The last thing to cover in this video is the pins, and holy shit, there are so many, I'm overwhelmed writing and reading the script. <laughs> So for time management, if the pins are released together during a drop, I will talk about them together. Okay? Cool? I hope we're cool because, listen man, I got like 38 pins to go through and my editor will kill me if I do these individually, so you don't have a choice. Take it or leave it. Alright, starting in order, we first have the Headshot Pin of Trial released on April 15th, 2019, alongside other headshots of the cast. Go cry about the range being between $15 to $200. You should have gotten it earlier. <laughs> We're just on October 9, 2019 with the Portrait of Charlie and the Demon Charlie pin. The Portrait one is going to be listed between $250 to $517.75, and the Demon Charlie listing is going to be between $225 and $237.50. Womp womp. Alright, now we get into 2020 where the Demon Alistair and Charlie pin was released on June 18, 2020 for a pre-order bonus for ordering the plushie bundle that I mentioned earlier in the video. There has been a fake in circulation. This user on Twitter.com was nice enough to discuss the differences between the two. The picture's probably gonna be on screen, the real one's on top, the fake one's on the bottom, and it shows you all the differences. It's been, mainly Charlie's the one that's fucked up looking that has all the differences. I, they did a real good job with Alistair, I guess. The range for a genuine one is going to be between $180.50. If you want a fake one, they're like $8 on Macari. <laughs> Alright, so it's summer now, and they dropped two pins of Charlie in 2020. We have the Hasbin Popsicle Pals and the Summer Date Pin. I will say that people on Macari have been making fake oh, pins yeah, the summer yeah. date pin to fool people. The range for a real one is going to be between $76.95 and $249.99. The price for the Popsicle Pals has only found one listing for it. It's going to be $150. Ooh, it's spooky season and they dropped four pins of Charlie. <laughs> The first two are a pin set, the Skull and the Zombie of the Hasbin Crew. These can range differently if you want the whole set or just Charlie. So the price for the Skull one is going to be between $15 to $200 and the Zombie one between $20 and $60. You can tell which pin set was popular. The normal pins are the Charlie Demon Shadow and then the Charlie and Vaggy Witch pin. The witch pin also has a fan-made pin since people like putting fakes in circulation. The range for the demon shadow is just 90, since I only found one. A real witch pin will range between 75 to 200. Black Friday has dropped in 2020, and with it came two Charlie theme pins: the Chibi Heart pin and the Demon Sweets pin. The Chibi Heart pin has Hi. a fake in on Macari right me. now, and it looks a normal really person. weird. Lots of the chibi pins have been turned to fake, so keep an eye out for those. <laughs> the ranges for the chibi Charlie pin is going to be between 16 to 150, and the demon sweets is going to range between 27 to 60. 
We also have pin sets from this drop too, with the gingerbread man and then the cute demon sets. The range for these is going to be 65 for the gingerbread ones, and then 29.92 to 199 dollars and 95 cents for the cute demons. Ooh, love is in the air, but not for your wallet, because we have way more to go and we're not even halfway through this goddamn list. <laughs> Alright, we had the pin of Charlie pin in the Chibi Love Valentine's Day released on February 12, 2021. With the sexy Charlie one, she goes for $159.95, so $332.50. Well, the Chibi Love goes from 80 to 100. Alright, spring came and it dropped off a singing Charlie pin. On May 12, 2021. It was very popular, kept getting restocked, retired now, now goes for $85 to $100. <laughs> Alright, so it's beachy or something. I don't know. I'm running out of creative ways to do segues right now. So, anyway, uh, summer of 2021 released three Charlie pins for us Swimsuit Charlie, Sunscreen Couple, and the Tiki Hotel Guest. Swimsuit Charlie? $8.96 says $69.99. Sunscreen couple, $9.93 to $200. You already know that $200 number came from eBay. And the Tiki Hotel guests went from $14 to $40. Yeah, the Tiki one wasn't that popular. It was on the website for a long time. Big one. Spooky, scary, skeleton, spooky. Alright, we got five pins from this jump. We have the Demon Charlie Gold, Demon Chibi Charlie. Glitch Charlie Gold, Trick or Treat Couple, and the Charlie Changing Portrait. Demon Charlie does have a fake in circulation as shown here for all the differences. Also the color is off on it, I'm just realizing too. Alright, speed run. 22 to $79.99 for the Demon Charlie. 20 to $129.95 for the Demon Chibi Charlie. 21 to 67 dollars and 69 cents for the witch charlie gold 25 to 49.99 for the trick-or-treat couple and 35 to 120 for the charlie changing portrait getting into the black friday drop of 2021 we have the chibi full body gold and the die struck pin sets the chibi gold can be found between 15 to 85 and the die struck between 50 to 100. Valentine's Day arrived in 2022 and dropped off four Charlie pins. We have the Valentine's Day Charlie plus Baggy heart pin between $16 to $199.09. The pin of Charlie plus Baggy pin between $23.75 to $100. The pin of Demon Charlie pin between $70 to $99.99. And the pin of Charlie number two pin between $18.73 to $100. Damn, is it hot in here, or is it just my wallet burning a hole in my pocket? <laughs> well, it's probably that, because this summer released three Charlie pins to throw your money at. We have the Swimsuit Charlie plus Baggy number two, Swimsuit Demon Charlie, and Swimsuit Charlie number two. The couple pin will run you between $16.90 to $199.99. The Demon one goes between $10 to $42.75. And the normal Charlie number two goes between 10 to 25. Oh damn, would you look at that? It's a pumpkin. It has to be Halloween since I found these two pins hiding behind it that are trying to avoid the scalpers like crazy. The Demon Charlie Glow in the Dark pin and the Witch Charlie Glitter pin. These will probably be the cheapest prices you're gonna find on this list. Demon Charlie goes for 15 to 25. And the Glitter Witch goes from 20 to 24. Black Friday didn't release much has-been hotel stuff, but it did drop off this cutie Charlie pin. It can be all yours between the prices of $18.05 and $125. Finally, we're at the final pin, released on February 13, 2023, is the Pin Up Charlie plus Baggy number 2. The price range is going to be between $35 to $199.99. You can already tell that that $200 amount came from eBay. Alright, the moment that we've all been waiting for. After calculating everything I brought up in this video, the range for collecting every piece of merch listed is going to run you between 
$2,802.64 and $9,803.12. I know some stuff wasn't included in this list, like the mugs and the playmats, mainly since they're limited run and hard to find secondhand, but if you want to get them, go for it. Who am I to stop you from throwing money at things? I'm not one to talk at all. <laughs> I recommend for all collectors of any characters to save search results for Hasbun Hotel and Hell the Boss to get the merch items when they first get put on sites like eBay and Makari. Also, look for people selling in a bundle or a lot. You might find the item cheaper that way. But anyway, thanks for watching. I highly appreciate it. This was a long time coming. And it's about time I tackle big topics like this and whatnot. So, so I hope you guys enjoyed this little look into Charlie's merch and whatnot. It's almost like a record almost of like everything. I mean, there are some things that wasn't mentioned, like t-shirts and playmats and mugs and whatnot. But you, if you want to get them, go off boo. You, you go try to find those things secondhand. They're hard to find. <laughs> A little after this video comes out, there will be a poll in the uh, community tab if you guys want to vote on who the next character I get to look into the merch of. Uh, it's mainly going to be like more Hell of a Boss focused, but I'll throw in a Hasman character in there somewhere. Be sure if you did like watching this video, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more Vizzy Pop content. I also do other stuff like gaming and live streams and whatnot if that interests you. We also do Wattpad readings where we discuss the good and bad on Wattpad, so, I mean, we have priority while you're waiting for the next Busy Pop merch drop or the next dissection, so. Alright, anyway, I'm gonna go take a nap. <laughs> See ya.